This math knowledge practice test question for the ASVAB and PiCat says, what is the average of one third, one half, and one fourth? Now, to find the average of any numbers that you're given, what you're going to do is add those numbers together. So we're going to do one third plus one half plus one fourth. And then we're going to divide that sum by how many numbers we added together. So we added one, two, three numbers together. All right, in order to do this problem, uh, we first have to add one third, one half, and one fourth together. And I'm going to do that off to the side so it's very clear as to how I do that. We have one third plus one half plus one fourth. In order to add fractions, they have to have the same or a common denominator. In this case, we have a denominator of three, two, and four. Well, as it happens, 3, 2, and 4 all go into 12, so 12 is going to be our common denominator. So let's go ahead and rewrite all these with a denominator of 12. To make 3, 12, we would have to multiply it by 4. We're also going to do that to its numerator. Again, 3 times 4 is 12. 4 times 1 is 4. To write 2 as 12, we would have to multiply it by 6. We're also going to do that to its numerator. 2 times 6 is 12. 1 times 6 is 6. So 1 half is the same thing as 6 over 12. To write 4 as 12, we're going to multiply it by 3. We also have to do that to its numerator. 4 times 3 is 12. 1 times 3 is 3. Now that these all have the same denominator, we're going to keep our denominator, denominator the same. And then we're going to add our numerators. So this is going to be 4 plus 6 plus 3. You should be able to do that part mentally. 4 and 6 is 10, plus 3 is going to be 13. So this is 13 over 12. All right, so this becomes 13 over 12 divided by 3. Now, what we're really doing here is dividing fractions because, again, I could write 3 as a fraction by placing it over 1. And when you divide two fractions, you follow the algorithm, keep, change, flip. It is to say we're going to keep this top fraction the same. So this becomes 13 over 12. We're going to change from division here to multiplication, and then we're going to flip this bottom fraction. So instead of being 3 over 1, we're going to write it as 1 third. When you multiply fractions, you multiply straight across. So this becomes 13 times 1, which is 13. Uh, 12 times 3 is going to be 36. So the average of 1 third, 1 half, and 1 fourth is 13 over 36. As it happens, we can't reduce this. So the correct answer to this one is going to be B.